Hey, what's up guys? It has been quite a while and I apologize for that. Monday night after I posted the uh, Emblem of the Week video, my girlfriend got really sick so I was over with her taking care of her and then Tuesday she still wasn't feeling that great so I was still over there with her and while I was with her I got kind of sick because apparently if you hang around stick people you get sick. I'm pretty sure I kind of said stick there because of I got stuck. Anyway, on to this game. I don't have very much to talk about, so I'll just try to comment on the game. I am rocking the AK-74 with a grip. I know, real common, but if you'll see some of the challenges I complete in this game, I actually, you can tell that I don't use this gun very much at all. I really don't use any of the submachine guns that much. I just prefer assault rifles or occasionally the M60. But uh, the, this game does start kind of slow, but it does pick up. I do start to do a little bit better later on. But bear with me here at the start. I do kind of get slaughtered. Not really slaughtered, but probably, I guess I would say, close to one to one. I get that kill, but that guy completely juked me out and took me out. Which, nothing wrong with that. I'm pretty sure this game was a not too much BS sort of thing, so I did deserve my deaths. Um, that guy likes to sit in the corner. It's okay. I mean, I know it's only cool people that sit in corners. But it's cool because it did spawn me by C, which really isn't fair to them. But I'll take advantage of it and then I'll kill this guy who tries to stop me. Because that's the type of guy I am. I, I like to shoot people in or around the face. But there's that guy in the corner again because he is awesome. Because only awesome people sit in corners. I uh, go to flank him here, but I believe if I'm remembering right that someone's already taken him out. Or no, actually, it's that he moved. He was a kind of smart camper, which is the worst kind. I'm running through, and then they get shot in the back because he's moved on to a new corner. That might even be a different guy, I don't know, but uh, that doesn't make it any less douchey. I'm pretty sure douchey is just a fun word to say. Moving on, uh, perk. I'm running the standard submachine gun rush kit, the marathon lightweight steady aim. Uh, shot that guy in the back, which is kind of how this game goes. Uh, I guess I'll make this an educational video um, and kind of a bragging video because I was really impressed on the weekly uh, domination leaderboards. At one point, I got ranked like a hundred and something. I was like really happy about that. So, uh, just to do good in domination, really the only advice I'm going to give is play the objective. Um, people, honestly, I know love to sit, go into these game modes and just whore out kills, but uh, the way this is set up, if you want to do good, play the objective. You'll get more points. Honestly, if you're playing it right, you'll probably even get more kills, assuming you're you do okay. I mean, if you're not that great, then, you know, you might die a lot, but you'll still get a lot of points capturing independent objectives. Um, for for instance, uh, Amber Dillo, the girl that we play with, I, w I watched her seriously get 10 captures in the game, and that was crazy to me. Like, no matter how hard I try, I can rush from objective to objective, but I still won't get 10 captures. Uh, it doesn't even seem physically possible to me, but she pulled it off. She died a lot, but she was still really high up on our team because, you know, 10 captures is 1,500 points alone right there. Uh, I don't remember if she had, I think she had one or two defends and, you know, a few kills. Not that many and a lot of deaths because apparently when you're doing the objective, and you, you'll die a lot. But, yeah, so uh, don't be afraid to do the objective. Um... You know, and there is more than one objective. You do have to defend points as well, but don't focus on that. You should always focus on capturing points. Um, a lot of people like to use that excuse, oh, I'm defending the point. Yeah, no. Just no, that's a fancy way of saying I'm whoring kills and I'm too scared to actually rush the objective. Because if you're defending one point, but uh, the enemy has two points, 
you still lose, no matter how many defends on that point you get. So, you still look like an ass. Uh, people in this other domination game we were playing, I think two people on their team had a 40 something kills, maybe 50, I could be, I don't know. And one of them had one capture and like two defends. One of them had maybe two captures. And the people on our team, I don't think anyone had more than 20 kills, but uh, we raked the crap out of them in Domination. Because no matter how many kills they get, it, it, that's not how you win the game. It's not how you get a high score. It's pretty much... There's nothing. There's no point in doing that. So, that is my lecture slash rant for the day. Do kill those couple of guys. Move on to this guy. Yay. This AK-74 really does tear people up. Uh, run over here to try to stop them from capturing A, but apparently he just decided to run through because he's too cool for the objective. Plus 90 for an assist. Plus a kill. And now just kind of sticking around this building while... Then there's me being stupid. There is... Honestly, I think anyone else probably actually would have gotten that knife kill, but the fact that I even tried that is kind of stupid. Frag wound despite throwing it at A because, again, I didn't stick around for the objective. Mow people down in the back. And yay! Headshots. I do love how this game turned out. It started off so slow and so depressing. I thought I was going to get the enforced one to one kill to death ratio, but honestly, it just turned great. They do keep trying to come through here, so. <laughs> you take a couple of them out. I thought I was going to get an impressive spray, but then I went after the wrong guy, got that kill, and died because I did not play that one smart. Attack dogs going out, doing some work. Not my attack dogs, granted, but I like this guy. This guy is just sitting there defending against from the dogs, and I'm not even sure if he had any idea I was coming up on top of him. Giggity. Take C. And die. But, that is domination. I do pretty good there. A few more deaths than I would have liked, but, you know. That's gonna happen. So, a moral of the story. Capture objectives. Play the objective. Don't whore kills. Thank you for your time.